up everyone this is Jonathan Darnell life I'm Jonathan Darnell and welcome to my channel <laughs> all right guys I am super super excited I am hyped I am ready because today I'm doing a follow-up video on my last vlog and on my last vlog I actually was talking about if you watched it I was actually talking about some different herbs that I was gonna be taking to clean up my body so guess what I have all the herbs here with me now so without further ado let's jump right into it you ready let's go all 12 herbs that's right all 12 of them they right here and they right now Wait, 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 let me, let me grab, make sure I ain't leave one. Let me grab them all, let me grab them all. Wait, 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 wait. All 12 herbs. <laughs> I got them all, baby. Yes, yes, yes. I'm excited, guys. I'm super excited. All right, so what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be actually drop one. Putting them all in this bag right here, mixing them all up. I'm going to be boiling them. So let's get started. First up, we have sarsaparilla yes sarsaparilla <laughs> sarsaparilla next up we have damiana damiana leaf another good herb and these are all alkaline herbs too by the way which means they break down mucus in the body that has accumulated over a period of time of eating foods that aren't so healthy for the body all right so next up we have Malayan leaf another great herb yes so let's dump them all in together all right next up we have being a Greek this herb here is actually a seed and can be sprouted and it's very good for women's body too. If you're trying to produce milk, breast milk, it's very good for the female body, good for the male body too. Um, this, next up we have elderberry. Oh my gosh, these are actual berries. Ooh, they smell kinda good too. Mm, I'm gonna try one, hey, hold on. <laughs> hold on, I gotta try one. Oh, it is gonna be good. Mm. Oh man, it actually tastes like a berry too. Ooh, what? Those are actually good. Very high in iron too, iron phosphate. So next up we have bladder rack. Now this is ideally for the liver. Clean it. All right. Next up, we have blue vervain. And that elderberry is actually good. Either I'm hungry. <laughs> All right, next up we have burdock roots. Very, very ideal for the liver. Whole body, full of iron, full of iron. So if you need an iron supplement, maybe check out some burdock roots. I did. Next up we have wormwood. Wormwood, another good herb. Also alkaline. And oh man, it's kind of bitter. Next up we have black walnut hole. Give it up for black walnut hole. <laughs> Next up we have dandelion roots. Yes. Very interesting plant actually grows about I think it can grow as deep as 15 feet in the soil oh my gosh well, I did not know I had so many herbs chaparral the next herb up and dang oh my gosh make sure I'm not leaving with nothing out one two three four five six seven eight nine ten Wait, 11, I shouldn't leave nothing out. I think I got everything guys, 12. I have all 12 herbs right here. All 
All 12 herbs. Now that is a lot of herbs. Man. Woo. I just want to mix them all up. And that should be good enough. Man, look at that. That is a lot of herbs, y'all. Dang, that's a lot. <laughs> that is a lot. Alright, so... We have them all mixed up now. Next up, I'm actually gonna try these herbs out, guys. Yep, you guessed it. I'll try them out right here, right now. A cup of water. We add one more cup. Two cups of water. All right, so, got my water. Make sure you get this going. And we are good. So, while we're waiting on that, I have a list of all the herbs that I actually <laughs> have, I'm gonna be drinking today, I'm making the tea with. And the herbs are, we named them all. So, while we're waiting on that, I might as well just talk about some of them. Why not? Bladder rack. And I'll just like go with a couple facts. Just some fun facts. It's a strong flavor, high in fiber, very high in iodine, kicks up your metabolism. It's great for weight loss, makes you feel full, kills bacteria, has vitamins A and K, has beta carotene, which is great for the eyes, helps you stay away from osteoporosis. Um, also, Gets rid of redness or flakiness on the skin. Red puffy skin, helps produce collagen. Helps relieve constipation, healthy gut. It is a seaweed and discovered around 1811. Grows on the coast of the North Sea, uh, the Baltic Sea and the Atlantic Pacific Ocean. Uh, so this is a seaweed. All right guys, so my water is finished boiling. Ooh, that's hot. Yes, yes, yes. And now is the moment we've all been waiting for. Now we gotta do better. Yes. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take the herb. And I'm gonna use about probably put like one. Uh, two tablespoons. Ooh. That should do it. Man, I'm excited. Ah, I am excited. So excited. Because I get to remove unnecessary elements that don't belong in my body. sit for about 10 minutes and play the waiting game so I'm hyped guys this is the this is like I'm doing this because I feel like it's necessary um it's just you know hey I'm like you know what I know I've been eating not eating like I should I know I haven't been just eating all the right foods all the time. So you know what, let me do this cleanse. So here I am. So let's start that timer from three minutes. I'm just gonna let it steep. All right, so this has been steeping now. My tea has been steeping for about seven minutes. So the moment of truth, I'm gonna see what this stuff tastes like. Gosh, I hope it don't taste horrible. 
ザーザーザーザ